Hello, my YouTube family and friends. How are we today? It's your girl, Riri, and I'm back. Oh, I missed you guys since my last video. I've been wanting to come sooner, and I couldn't make it, but I'm back today, and I am so happy to be back. I had a friend tell me that when I made my pepper steak that she couldn't quite see me make the hot water cornbread. So I thought today, since I had a little time, I would come through for you guys, especially her, and make the hot water cornbread. So as you can see, I have a clear bowl that we'll be using. I have some water so I can rinse my hands as I make my patties and put them in because they're going to be super hot and that way that'll cool off my hands. I have salt and of course, cornmeal. So. Over here, I have some water. We're gonna put that on the bowl. And as that's boiling, I'm gonna start heating up my pan also in the back for the patties. Okay, so let's get started. Let's get it popping. Okay. So, we're gonna take, hmm, I think about maybe two cups would be enough for us to, um, make a good amount, maybe uh, how many patties? Let's see. That'll probably make like three patties. So we'll probably have like six to eight patties. Okay. All right. Oh, I miss you guys so much. I just love coming here doing videos for you guys. Trust me, I believe, because I do. So, here, we don't quite need a tablespoon, maybe just like a teaspoon, like about that much. We're going to put that in, and now we're going to mix it, okay? This is all we have to do to get the hot water cornbread, and you can eat it with beans, greens, like spaghetti, it's delicious, and today, I'm going to be cooking it in some Crisco butter. So that makes it super good. Now I know a lot of people like eating healthy. You can use olive oil, avocado oil, take your choice, canola oil if you wish. Um, it'll come out perfect every time. So we're just gonna mix this up and then we're gonna pour the hot water in once it's boiling and we're gonna get this party started. So, I'm gonna come up with something good for the next time. I can't wait. If you wish, you can leave me a comment if you have anything uh, you would like to see me cook. I'll be glad to get it going for you. You know, I like to get it popping. So, all you have to do is just let me know, okay? I think I'm a good cook, and I think basically I can mostly like cook anything, but you know, I like a challenge, so let me know. Okay, our hot water is getting hotter. So soon we'll be ready to pour that in and get it started. So now once we get it started, we have to get the consistency where we can make like a patty, like a hamburger patty. So that's what we'll be looking for. So you have to, there's no way to like measure it. So we have to, um, kind of figure like the consistency where to make a patty you know you have to work with it and you don't want it to fall apart you don't want it all mushy and wet so you can't put too much so you gotta really be careful when it comes to the water so we have a ball going here now so we're just gonna put that in start adding it and see the consistency of it okay Let's see how much that does. Get it stirring here, and we won't know till we're till we get it to the perfect point. Now, see, that's not enough water, so we're gonna have to add some more. Uh, but it's gonna be so delicious. Mm. I like my hot water cornbread, especially with cabbage. And that's one of my specialties. When I make some cabbage for you guys, trust me, you're gonna love it. So, coming back over here, we're gonna put some boiling water. 
You don't want to put too much. So, I'm going to take it right here. Oh, look at that. Looks like we might um, have it right there. Looks like it. Looking good. Looking good. Mmm. Mmm. And I bet it's going to taste good. Yeah, I believe that's it. It's a wrap. Look at that. I believe it's ready to make the patties. Oh, yeah. So, let's see how everything else is coming along. Okay. So, we're just going to take this off. We don't need any more hot water. Put that away. And I'm going to rinse my hands. And we're going to get started. All right. So now, I'm just going to take out like a spoon of this. Small, a little bigger, and this is hot, trust and believe. So now I'm just going to put it in the skillet. There's one. Come back over here, rinse my hands. water on your hands. Feels so good. Okay. Then this is number three. Just gonna move it over. Get this one in there. And I believe we have room for one more. How sweet is that? Now, if you ever want to take this and you want to make like weed or you want to add other stuff, you can. And I was thinking actually about doing a challenge where I would do five or ten days with making hot water cornbread and adding things, different things like we could add sugar and, and put on a powdered sugar on top or we could add raisins or pinto beans or even maybe black eyed peas. That's one of my favorites, you know be so good. Okay. And now we have all four in the skillet. And I'm just going to rinse my hands here. And dry them. Oh, and we can't forget, we need a spatula. Can get a spatula so we can Flip it and it's done on one side and put it on the other side. Okay? So, how you guys been? Oh my goodness. I've been great. Been waiting and waiting and waiting to get back on here so I can say hi to you guys and hello and how are you and all that good stuff. I missed you on Valentine's Day. I didn't have time. I wish I would. I tried to get in to do a video, but time was short. So anyway, we're going to let that cook a little. And I think we can kind of look at the first one I put in and check on it and see how it is. See that kind of gold color? Dirt. And mmm, look at that. That golden flavored color. Look at that. Looks pretty good. So now I'm just going to flip the other ones over. I think they're about ready. Oh, yeah. Looks like we're going to have some golden. 
pop water cornbread. Hmm, I don't quite know what I'm going to eat with this yet because I didn't plan on that. I just planned on getting it made so you guys could enjoy it. My friend could see and also you could see. Wouldn't want to hold it back from me, you know? So... Yeah, we'll just let that cook a little bit. And I'll come back over here and I'll kind of roll up my next patty to come in and then we can get that ready. We can just make them into a patty, a ball first, you know. Let's see how that goes. And then I'll just have to flatten it when I put it in the bowl. So, actually... I said between six and eight, right? We have seven. We have seven patties that we're gonna end up having. Okay, and I'm just gonna rinse my hands in here. And I think those are about ready to be removed out the bin. All right, put a paper towel over here. I'll just bring these over here, make it more easier for me. Okay, so now this one pretty much is done with that and you can see, mm. I kind of like a little deeper dark color, you know, so we'll just let that go just a little bit longer. I love doing videos for you guys. Yeah, I look forward to a whole bunch of good, good cooking. And I can't wait. Really can't wait. So we're just going to remove these now because they're ready. And then I'll be adding my other ones. And then we'll be done. Now you see how quick that was? I don't actually know how quick that was, but I would say that took about maybe six minutes, eight. How cool is that to fry some bread up that quick? So, just gonna put these there. And then I'm glad you all could see and you enjoy this little video with me. I know if I had more time, it would have been longer. But just know I love you and I love making videos for you. And I need you to like, share, and subscribe so you can come back and get the rest of my videos that I have lined up for you for the future okay so this is it basically you can see you have some golden fried hot water cornbread okay and I'm just gonna go and let that cook and don't forget to come back to like to share with your friends and family and to subscribe to my channel so we can get it popping some more with some more good food, okay? I will be here for you, and I will cook it for you, and I will explain it to the fullest, and you'll love it, I promise you, okay? All right, until next time, I'll see you then, okay? Enjoy!